This is a story all about how my life got flipped, turned upside down. And I'd like to take a minute, just sit right there. I'll tell you how I became the prince of a town called Bel Air. In West Philadelphia, born and raised on the playground is where I spent most of my days. Chilling out, maxing, relaxing, all cool and all shooting some b-ball outside of the school. When a couple of guys who were up to no good started making trouble in my neighborhood. I got in one little fight and my mom got scared and said, you're moving with your auntie and uncle in Bel Air. Good morning, Cougars. I'm Bria, and today is Thursday, March 25th, 2021. And I'm Olivia, and it's a white day. Please rise and join us for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. For today's lunch, we have mini corn dogs or breaded chicken sandwich. The premium choice is cheese or pepperoni pizza. And the sides are corn, refried beans, and applesauce cup. It's time for a joke. What did the ranch say when, they, when you opened the fridge? I don't know what. Close the door. I'm still dressing. Oh, I get it. Hey, it's March, which means we have been focusing on a new character word. Yes, we have. And for this month, it's cooperation. And it means working together for a common goal. This is a great skill for when you are working with your classmates on group projects. Or when you're playing a sport with your teammates. Listen up, 8th graders interested in playing volleyball next year at Park Hill High School. Open gyms will be April 5th, 7th, and 12th from 4 o'clock to 5.30 in the upper gym. Please contact Coach Hood with questions at hoodl at parkhill.k12.mo.us. Attention all 7th graders, you will have the opportunity to apply for National Juniors Honor Society, NJHS, beginning April 9th. While that, while that is still a ways away, we wanted to let you know about this opportunity so that you can get, make sure your third quarter grades meet the requirements. You must have a 3.75 GPA or higher for third quarter to qualify to participate. Those who do will receive a letter of qualification and then can apply for next year. With the pandemic this year, we weren't able to do as many things as we had in previous years. But here are some reasons why you should apply for NJHS. It's an honor to be inducted into NJHS, and it looks really good on your resume heading into high school and college. NJHS does service projects for school. Some that we have done in the past include recycling, help to plan fun activities for incentives for students, concessions for school play, and teacher appreciation. And JHS also does service projects outside of school. Some that we have done in the past include volunteering at KC Pet Project and Harvesters. These are field trips that we take during the school day. Applications will start to be available on April 5th. You must have a 3.75 or higher for third quarter to qualify to participate. Those who do will receive a letter of qualification and can then apply for next year. So, spend these next several weeks making sure your grades are in tip-top shape and that you're getting your work turned in. If you have questions about NJHS, see Ms. Kenchlow in room 111 or Ms. Butler in room 108. Track kids need to be released today at 2. Also, the Student Council application due date has been extended to 11.59 p.m. on Tuesday, April 6. This is your chance to be a leader in our school, so don't miss out on this amazing opportunity. So, applications are due by the night of April 6th. Are there any other important dates we should know about? All the info is on the application, but STUCO advisors will send you an email about interviews, which will take place the week of April 12th. And then congrats and condolence emails will be sent out on the afternoon of Friday, April 23rd. Sounds good. STUCO is looking forward to meeting some great student leaders. Don't forget, there are still copies of the 2019-2020 yearbook available for purchase. That's right, Cougars. We have several copies of this amazing book still available in case you did not get yours last year. If you would like to get your hands on one of these historical yearbooks, you can come see Ms. Fetch, room 502, before or during tutorial. 
You should only come down if you have the money with you. They are on sale for $20. That is a great deal. Again, if you want one, you need to go to room 502 during tutorial time and only if you have the money with you. Get your copy of the 2019-2020 yearbook now. You may have already had the chance to show your appreciation for our wonderful social worker, Mrs. Ritsky. She has been such an awesome resource and a trusted person for so many students. If you haven't already, help us create a Wordly where we shower her with lots of words and encouragement. Your teachers will have the directions for how, to, how you can pr participate. Also, if you see Ms. Ritsky today, don't forget to let her know how amazing she is. Listen up, Cougars. We have five amazing staff members who will be retiring this year, and we will miss them dearly. Yes, we will. Congratulations to all of our retirees. And we don't want them to leave without letting them know how much we appreciate them. If you would like to, if you would like to leave a special message for Mr. Hill, Mrs. Olson, Mrs. Ritchie, or Mrs. Linegar, or Mrs. Weishar, please email Ms. Vetch at V-E-T-S-C-H-B at parkhill.k12.mo.us. And we will make sure to include your sediments in the yearbook for our special retirees. Again, send your message to vetchb at parkhill.k12.mo.us by this Friday, and let's give these awesome retirees a great send-off. Make sure you're showing our amazing teachers how much you appreciate all that they do. That's right. What a better way to show love and appreciation for our teachers than to fill out a Think a Teacher form. Teachers, please have your students open their laptops after our show. Go to Congress webpage and complete a Think a Teacher slash staff member form now. All NJHS kids need to report to the cafeteria for a picture for yearbook right after the show ends. We only need five to eight minutes of your time, so please come down with a cooperative and responsible attitude. Well, that's all for today. I'm Bria, and today is Thursday, March 25th. And I'm Olivia, and it's a white day. Have, Have a, a great, great day, day Cougars. Cougars.